How's it going guys? Rebel here coming at you guys with a brand new video and today we're going to be doing a video on the brand new foot birthday promo that is coming out Friday. Now if you guys do not know what foot birthday is, it's um, it's basically the anniversary of Ultimate Team when EA first created it. So it'll be 10 years and with it being 10 years, a whole decade since uh, Ultimate Team came out, I'm expecting something really really big. And based on my predictions and the tweets and the leaks and everything that, everything that I've seen, I do think it is going to be the biggest foot birthday promo, maybe the best promo of the year. Um, but yeah, we're going to get right into it. Before we get into it, if you guys could please leave a like, comment down below uh, what player you guys want to see the most. And don't forget to subscribe and follow my Twitch and click the little bell on the notification on my YouTube and Twitch so you know when I go live. Because sometimes I go live on YouTube and sometimes I go live on Twitch. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. So if you load into Ultimate Team, you will be greeted with a banner that says da, 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 foot birthday promo. No, it doesn't say promo, it just says foot birthday starts in one day in 21 hours. That means that it's going to be coming out on Friday. Now, I do not know what time it is for you guys, but for me, it's 11 p.m. Pacific Standard Time that it's going to come out or a.m. I mean, my bad. So I think it's 6 p.m. UK time. I'm not sure. You guys are used to it. You guys know when it comes out by now. But yeah, we're going to be greeted with a brand new promo on Friday morning or Friday afternoon, depending on what you guys are living in time zone wise. But we're going to go ahead and go look at the first leak that I ran across, came across today. So if you go on to the Russian EA Twitter, I do not know what it says because I do not speak, read Russian. So I was able to get it translated by someone named Tillian1243 on Twitter. And this is what it says. 21 players will be in packs. 21 players will be in packs. That's going to be all tradable players. Um, you could pack those, sell them. They're, those are going to be the tradable ones. Those are going to be the packs. Those are going to be how EA makes their money. 21 players in packs. Second one, 21 players in SPCs. That's actually, <laughs> that's pretty crazy because if you think about it, Footmiss was not even 21 players. Uh, icons are not 21 players. That's just crazy. Imagine having 21 players in your SBC thing that'll be insane 21 players just sitting here all foot birthday it'll take up like four or five pages that'll be crazy if they actually come out with 21 players and it's not just false but I think it is legit because EA's Russian Twitter account tweeted that out and they wouldn't be tweeting it out if it wasn't for no reason uh, moving on to the third one six players in the week weekly objectives now I'm really really excited about this one because as you guys know for the carnival one we were greeted with a uh, with a weekly objective that everybody including myself hated but the reward coming out of it was amazing because i did get that emery can emery chan the taliska the waya and the ben arfa and as you see right here taliska is in my starting lineup as well as can down here he's in the bench i bring him in but i really really love this idea of getting players in the weekly objectives because it just opens up so many like not opportunities, but like ways to just have fun on the game and just enjoy it compared to just sweating in weekend league or division rivals trying to get some coins, packs, whatever. This way you at least try new players and then you get you guarantee yourself a player of your choosing. It's not just a random player. Like if you go into foot champs, say you go 30 and 0 and you want a team of the week messy and then you end up pulling like a I don't know, like a Carvajal or something like that. I mean, that's still pretty good. You'd probably get something worse in a Carvajal, but something like that. This way, you know what you're playing for and the grind at the end is worth it. And that's the, that's like my interpretation of these weekly objectives because I do think they are worth it. Um, moving on. Actually, that's the end of the list. I don't know why I'm saying moving on, but 21 players in an SBC, 21 players in an SBC. That's crazy. 21 players in packs and six players in weekly objectives. And according to my math, my calculations, if I am correct, 21 plus 21 plus 6 equals 48 players in the foot birthday promo. 48 players. That's actually crazy. <laughs> if they come out with 48 players, that'll be insane. But yeah, those are going to be, those are the leaks, the confirmed leaks. I don't know if they're real. I'm pretty sure they are. They're leaks from directly from the EA Russian Twitter account. If you don't believe me, go check them out. It'll probably still be on there. But those are the exact same words that EA's Russian Twitter account tweeted out. So moving on, I know this isn't like an accurate, 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 accurate des description of the players that are going to be coming out. But I have a concept here from someone that goes by the name of SimpleBlue88 on Instagram. You guys could go ahead and follow him. 
um, he created a concept of the players that will be coming out. I'm going to be putting it on the screen right here. And you guys could let me know if you guys want to see those players. What players do you want to see the most? Personally, from these players, the player that I would want to see the most is probably that Lozano striker. <laughs> That'd be insane, that Lozano striker. Or that Munier, um, that Munier CDM. Because at CDM, he will be absolutely insane. I know he will be insane at CDM. Because I've switched his right back in form into CDM. And he plays absolutely amazing. And another one that I want to see on there is that Bernardo Silva at Cam. Um, I usually switch Bernardo Silva on my draft or I sub him in on at cam and he's really really good He like never loses a ball. So I'd want to see that foot birthday Bernardo Silva at cam and look at the car designs on them guys. Look at them. There's like balloons in the background uh, Confetti stuff like that. That's a really sick car design I know they've kind of had that from the past years But this one looks really really sick and it being the 10th anniversary of ultimate team I'm really expecting something crazy so 48 players is actually pretty accurate, if I do say so myself. Uh, moving on to the weekly objective ones, we have a Komen. Now, as you guys know, it said six will be out in the weekly objectives, and he only has one. But that would be a really, really cool card. A uh, Komen right wing position change, of course. To, um, that's a really, really sick card. I don't know if that's going to come out, but that'd be really cool. It'd be worth it. I'd definitely grind my games out, even if it meant playing like 20, winning 20 French, French games with uh silvers actually no that'd be terrible that'd be so so bad that'd be terrible that'd be absolutely terrible if i had to play 20 games win 20 games with silver players that are french that'd be so so bad i probably wouldn't do it but moving on to the sbc part you have a center defensive mid marquinhos uh mertens left wing and a coutinho cam i really really want to see that coutinho i'd love him as well as that marquinhos imagine that perfect link to neymar you wouldn't need to get like a brazilian team around him anymore to link him up but yeah, that'd be really sick. Either one of those for the SBCs I'd really, really love. Especially that Coutinho. But I don't know if Coutinho would get one, actually, because he already had a foot miss card. But I don't know. That one looks really, really cool. But that's going to be the end of the video, guys. Those are just some concepts, ideas. But those leaks, I'm pretty sure, are for certain. So if we do see 21 players in SBCs, that's going to be crazy. I'm going to be so hyped for that. Let me know the player that you guys want to see the most out of this whole promo whether it's like a old op player a flashback player i'm really really hoping for a flashback david via or iniesta um what are you guys looking for in this promo what are you guys doing are you guys selling all your players right now are you guys making a team right now are you guys waiting are you guys investing what are you investing in what are you doing i want to see what you guys think uh but thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe like comment and follow my twitch and i'll see you guys later peace